Hey guys, since the Super Bowl just ended, I thought I'd tell you a tale about the time I won my Super Bowl. The trophy? The belt you see in front of you. That's right, the Small Mouth Bass Championship of the World. This is an annual event held on the Tennessee River and is by invitation only. Now some fine fishermen challenge for this esteemed championship every year. This is a live bait event with the winner being the guy who lands the biggest smallmouth bass. This year's event even featured Burt Reynolds making a run at the belt. So I flew from New Mexico to Alabama in pursuit of this championship. Now I've spent 14 long years unsuccessfully chasing this belt. Some real legends have held this championship, but 2019 was finally my time. This year's event featured some tough adversaries, some of which fly straighter than others. Now this may be hard to believe, but I caught the winning fish on the first drift of the trip. It was an epic battle, all my skills being tested by this monster smallmouth. After this fish took me to the limit, I finally landed it. The fish weighed in at a whopping 5 pounds, 10 ounces. And it was at this point, 15 minutes into the event that I realized it was all over. There was no way any of these clowns were going to top 510. It must have been excruciating knowing it was over 15 minutes into the competition. However, it was three days of jubilation for me as the event continued till the very end. I was on top of the world as the belt was presented to me. After 14 long years, all the hard work and dedication finally paid off. Now my victory wasn't without some controversy. There were a few jealous competitors who uh, questioned and continue to question the validity of that 510 weight. So check out these photos of the winning fish and let me know in the comments if you think this massive smallmouth weighed 510 or not. And if not, let me know what you think it weighed. Thanks for watching.